Guys, it's been a long as time since I've made a video, and sorry I look like a mess. I've been cleaning my room for like three hours now, but everything's clean, as you can see. And I'm gonna make a really big update video um, of everything since it's been so long since I made a YouTube video. Um, this is the boa. He's gotten huge. Um, I plan on getting him a female, probably not anytime soon, but sometime soon. Um, this is Jay, one of my little normal males. He's buried in here, but he used to be tiny, but he's gotten huge. So he's like a beast. Oh my god, a digital scale. So I finally weighed everybody. He was like 439 grams. Here's Bob. Bring him out. Oh, damn it, Bob. You got Aspen on my floor. I, I just vacuumed. Yeah, you see me back. Anyways. <coughs> There's Bob. He pretty much like doesn't grow anymore. So that's why I'm pretty sure he's a male. But he's been doing great. He's just same old Bob. He's a normal male by the way. If anyone's watching this video, who doesn't know. Put him away. Cooperate with me. Cooperate. Take, take. Thank you. Sorry for the motion sickness, people. But I have both right on who's not cooperating with me. So down here, we don't have anything because that would be my pastel who's in with my psycho female right now. Here we have a uh, blood python who it's finally, finally, finally eight, but on his own. Um, he didn't strike like usual, so I left it in with him, and it was gone in the morning. So I'm hoping he keeps up his good habits and can maybe grow now. Since I've had him for almost like eight months, and he hasn't grown or even on his own. Um, over here, here, well, let's do snakes before we get to Peter. I have my pastel, who looks great, he just came out of his shed. And if you guys see a little demented thing back there who calls himself a ball python, then I'm going to close the tub. But that's my normal female who weighed in at 1800 grams. She's also a psycho. Um, right here we have Peter, my bearded dragon, whose colors are coming in great. As he gets older, he only gets brighter. He's in a 33 long. It's the same dimensions as a 55 gallon, but it's just shorter. He's got his UV and a heat lamp. Um, over here, he's got my I forget who I thought was a sun glow, but it turns out, as I was looking at more and more pictures of sun glows, she's a hypo tangerine. So, yeah. I think she's going to get a cricket for us, because she just realized one she ran past her. Why not? Nope, there's, there's no. We'll let her chase that. Oh, you cooperate. You both the way so I can put your hide back. Okay. She's in a 10 gallon. 
the heat pad on the bottom. Here is my albino leopard gecko, who's in the humid hive, so I'm just going to let her see some teeth in there. She's in a five and a half gallon with the heat pad, which I know is a little small for her, but it's most likely just temporary since I'm looking to sell her. Um, with that said, those are my reptiles and update on all of them. So yeah, expect more videos from me. I was just really slack in there for like a month. Uh, high school just started and I'm a freshman so I'm really not used to all like all the homework we get and all that stuff. But now I'm getting more used to it. Things are getting easier and I'll be making more videos. So yeah, peace out YouTube. See you again.